Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel Microsoft Office Learning. Today I will discuss three things with you. First, how to calculate hours, how to calculate minutes, and how to calculate hours and minutes in given data. Sometimes we need to find the hours and the minutes, especially when we are in HR department, we need to calculate the hours, minutes for the employee work so we can calculate their wages, deduct the tax, and make them payment on time and make the exact calculation. So let's start the video without wasting any time. Here I created a sample data. This is employee name, ID, clock in time, clock out when they leave. So first we'll calculate the hours, then we'll calculate the minutes separately, and then we'll calculate hours and minutes all together. So first start calculating hours. The formula is is equal to H O U or if I press tab it will pick the first cell reference is the clock out the time when the employee finish minus sign and then clock in cell reference G12 close of bracket and press enter so it's giving me the six hour there are these six complete hours between 9 to 25 past 3 just to make sure this is formula for hours so it will just provide me hours it will just provide me complete hours if i want to calculate the hours for the rest of the employees i just double click on it so it will give me the hours for the rest of the employees as well now we'll jump on to the second point which is to calculate minutes so the formula is is equal to m i n so on third number I click on it and press tab so it will pick the first cell reference is a clock out minus clock in cell reference close of bracket and press enter so it's giving me 25 it means in this timing in this clock in and clock out time there are 25 minutes so it's just providing me the minutes it ignores the hour between these two timings. It's just provide me the minutes. If I want to copy it, just double click on it. So it's providing me the minutes for the rest of the employees as well. So this is the method. How can we calculate the hours and minutes separately? Now the third thing and most commonly used hour and the minutes all together. This is more quickly and efficient to calculate hours and minutes all together so formula start with is equal to start of bracket h o u r press tab and then the first cell reference which is clock out time minus the clock in time cell reference which is g12 close of bracket this portion of the formula will calculate the hour okay now we need to calculate minute so we'll enter plus m i n on third number there is a minute press tab so again the first cell reference is a clock out time cell reference minus the clock in time cell reference and again the close of bracket slash 60 and the close of bracket why I enter the 60 because this portion of the formula will calculate minutes when it will calculate the minutes then we'll divide by 60 to convert it in hours because we we need to calculate the exact hour so we can calculate the exact wages of the employee so this formula works with the first portion calculate the exact hours second portion will calculate the minutes and then we'll convert the minute into hours so we can get the exact calculation for wages calculation purpose if i press enter so it's giving me 6.42 it means the alex employee work for 6.42 hours the clock in time was 9 o'clock and clock out time was 3.25 p.m. In these two timings, he worked from 6.42 hours. So further, we'll use these hours for calculation of wages for payroll purpose. Again, if I want to 
copy this formula just double click on bottom so it will calculate the hours for all of these employees work for 7 6.67 hours 7.17 7.33 hours so this is the way how we calculate the hours and the minutes all together i showed you the different ways first calculate the hours separately then calculate the minutes separately or the best thing is to calculate hours and the minutes all together with one formula i wrote down the formula is equal to hours start of brackets clock out time cell reference minus clock in time cell reference the second formula is to calculate the minute the start of bracket i8 minus 8 8 so this this is how you'll calculate the minutes if you want to calculate all together hours and minutes then the start of bracket hour start of bracket i8 minus 8 8 plus minute start of bracket i8 minus 8 8 slash 60 why will we use the 60 because we'll convert the minute into hours to calculate the exact hour for wages calculation purpose so this is the way you can calculate hours and minutes so i really hope so you like this video make sure to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so you don't miss any upcoming videos so i see you guys in next video